With a nip of fall in the air, people are heading to the Great Smokies. But one group that's planning a trip is upsetting many visitors. News 13's Rex Hodge is live from our Western News Center. Rex, who's coming and why are folks taking note? White supremacists are planning to meet in Tennessee, then take a walk through the Great Smoky Mountains National Park. It has some emotions running very high. You want to say cheese or Great Smoky Mountains? It's the time of year when it's picture perfect in the Great Smoky Mountains National Park. Many visitors think it's not the place for white supremacists. I just think that, um, that they ought to keep their opinions to themselves. A white supremacist conference is planned Saturday near Gatlinburg with what organizers are calling a nature walk through the park on Sunday. If it impedes people trying to just enjoy, you know, the, the park, yeah, I think that it's, it's a shame. The conference is organized by Stormfront, its website filling up with people signing up. Founder Derek Black inviting people to the all-white East Tennessee Smoky Mountains for workshops on immigration, politics, and to take a walk with former Ku Klux Klan Grand Wizard David Duke. No, I don't really care. Katrina Ragland is visiting from Ohio. And we've got white supremacists, Aaron Brotherhoods, we've got them all. And, you know, they don't bother me, I don't bother them. You know, their personal feelings is just that. To me, they're like hate groups. Angelica you know? Torres says the all-white rhetoric scares her. She says America is supposed to be inclusive, not exclusive. Barack Obama is African-American and white. You know, my grandchildren are Cherokee Indian, Cuban, Puerto Rican, and white. So we're a nation of multi-ethnic, multicultural groups. Also a nation with a First Amendment. They have free speech, they have a right, but it doesn't mean I agree with it at all. For Debbie Cooney and her husband, an uncomfortable acceptance. Oh, but as soon as I say, you can't do that, then, you know, my Christian beliefs might be stomped on it. The Great Smoky Mountains National Park says it has not heard from Stormfront, so no special use permits have been issued. Reporting live tonight from the Western News Center, Rex Hodge, News 13.